News alert, Spartanburg police are asking for your help to identify the person who's been burglarizing businesses, at least six of them so far. Our Scarlett Lizjack explains how police hope a cash reward will make a difference. On July 24th, Spartanburg police were called to Saki, Sushi and Hibachi on East Main Street for a burglary. Officers say the business's glass door was shattered, two cash registers were tampered with, and part of the security system was inside a fish tank. We're told that same evening, surveillance cameras were able to capture this image. Police believe this person is connected to the crime and possibly five other break-ins. What we realize is that uh, during that same uh, time frame, there were several uh, businesses that were broken into on the same day. It was in a short amount of time. It was after midnight, uh, but before 5 a.m. And so that's why we believe that these break-ins are connected. Uh, uh, the subject that we have in the photo uh, that we believe is involved in at least one uh, could be connected uh, to the other ones as well. Officers say all six break-ins happened to businesses on East Main Street. When each one of them, some kind of way, he made entry by using a rock or brick and throwing it to the windows. And so in, in many of the cases, uh, the windows were shattered uh, with a brick or some type of rock. Police believe the motive behind the crimes is cash. It looks like or appears uh, that the person that broke into the business were looking for cash because uh, in some of the cases there was a cash register that was taken or uh, they tried to enter a cash register and get money directly uh, from the store that was left over in their petty cash. Now police are offering up to a thousand dollar cash reward for information that leads to an arrest and conviction. A couple different techniques that we try to use to figure out who the person is uh, but one of the main thing is we have a, a good photograph and we believe based on that photograph that there's someone in the public that can identify him and will be able to give us that information. Spartanburg police are asking anyone with information on this case to contact them. We'll have that number listed on our website, WSPA.com. Reporting in Spartanburg, or Lillis Jack, 7 News. Uh, you saw that picture several times. Police believe, based on the photograph, that the person they're looking for has a tattoo on their forehead.